Hey everyone, it's Sean Abel. I just wanted to make a quick video update regarding my son Colin. As you know, Colin was having pain in his left leg. Went to get an ultrasound and that turned into an MRI. And that turned into an emergency trip to Salt Lake City for a biopsy. The results of the biopsy were bad. Synovial sarcoma and aggressive cancer. Colin's prospects do look pretty good though as we believe he caught the tumor early. Treatment is going to take the form of a new MRI on the 17th followed by a pretty invasive surgery on the 18th. Doctors will make a 7 to 8 inch incision starting at Colin's ankle going towards his knee. They will remove tendon, muscle, and bone to get at the tumor and remove it. They will then use radiation in an attempt to kill any cancer cells that might remain. Colin is scared and angry, and sad, and nervous. He wants to buy a bunch of video games to play with his little brother just in case he doesn't get the chance to later. His mood swings from being your typical carefree teen to wondering if he should make out a will. I just wish I could trade places with him. To make sure Colin gets the treatment he needs, he, his brother, mother, stepfather, and myself will need to be in Salt Lake City from the 16th to the 19th. We are paycheck to paycheck type families and the first trip has exhausted what little savings we had. The GoFundMe page is designed to raise money to get us to Salt Lake City and stay through this round of treatment. Rental cars, hotel rooms, meals, and a pretty uncertain future. As of right now, people have donated nearly $1,800, and the outpouring of support and well wishes have done a lot to provide hope in a pretty dire time. I'd like to personally thank all of the people you see on your screen for each of their individual donations. And if you would also like to donate, you can go to gofundme.com slash Colin Abel Cancer Treatment Fund. There'll be a link down in the description. If you can't donate, that's okay. You can still help by spreading the word sharing a link, your post, or this video, and talking to friends and family about Colin's situation. Again, a most heartfelt thank you to everyone whose hearts and minds are with our family. Words can never express my gratitude. And lastly, please pray for Colin, his doctors, and nurses. Thank you.